Lord of Wolverine back in action. I'm gonna smash some eggs. Ah, fuck, mate. It was an awful day at work. Uh, in the morning, I cleaned the eggs, as you just saw in the image before. And um, as soon as I got home, mate, uh, I just felt that smell again. I think that box of eggs is a goner. So it's. Sinto amor quando a saudade aperta. Shit, I just opened the, the incubator and it smelled like um, moldy eggs. And uh, first box, they are all moldy. I'm gonna try and treat them with some peroxide and and paper. Let's see how this goes. I'll try and save them. Okay, so the second box, the, they seem to be all right. I'll put uh, new, uh, whatever this paper is, the uh, baking paper, just uh, so that the water droplets don't fall on the eggs. This box is all right. The other box, I uh, use peroxide. Oh shit, this is in this is in Russian, but uh, it's H2O2 peroxide, and um, I just rub the eggs uh, all with um, the peroxide and dry them. Let's see if they survive. So today is the fourth of December, and I want to make a record of this. Oh. Um, Tomorrow I'm going to the, the pharmacy, the apotheca, and uh, buy some more peroxide. Mine is uh, running empty. And um, now I'm on that uh, box on the left, I'm going to keep um, a, a close eye. I'm going to pay more attention on a, a daily basis to the development of the, that fungus infection around all eggs. The second box was totally clear, but the first one, shit. Okay, so we are here with the moldy eggs and I'm gonna try and wash them again with a little bit oh this is a lot of mold so I put peroxide water on this paper yeah peroxide is reacting a lot so they are very very moldy these ones uh, you see all this white stuff that's the the peroxide reacting with the moldy part oh my gosh first day as you saw in a couple minutes ago on the images you had really big fungi growing up coming out of the egg now it's just superficial so I am going to try and combat these every day if necessary as in the hopes that uh, it won't spread to the interior of the egg let's see how it goes Okay, so this is the second box of eggs. I'm candling them and I can see veins. All right. I just candled the eggs on the, um, on the first box and I did not see the veins as I'm seeing on these ones. So I think the mold got them from inside. Shit. I think that box of eggs is a goner. So it's for me to learn. I watched all YouTube videos. I heard all the podcasts how to do it. That's all the theory that I got in here. But the experience, you know that um, the experience, it says a lot. So that's why I wanted this first clutch as an experiment. The female didn't breed the first time. Now I screwed up about uh, um, half of the clutch of eggs. Half, more than half, five. Uh, I hope I get the other box with four eggs good. But uh, shit, uh, I didn't have a good day at work and uh, now uh, I'm not doing any better. But uh, I'll clean up the, the eggs again. Just um, I got the theory, but uh, I gotta learn the practice. Maybe I should have used uh, boiled water. Uh, maybe I should have disinfected the container. Something that I, I need to do better not to... Because five out of five eggs develop mold on the inside. I clean the mold on the, ins on the outside and I think the bacteria is on the inside. Mate, uh, I don't think I can win this this one. Ah! Okay. Uh... Oh, it smells. It smells bad. It smells of mold. I don't like this. Um, let's check the. How do I? How do I say the? 
viability of the eggs. So I just use peroxide. Uh, this is H2O2, it's written in Russian. Oh, you can you see this white foaming? I think the, um, the mold is on the inside. They rotted on the inside. But um, I'm gonna try and keep fighting this for a while more. Ah, shit. Uh, that's what I was talking about, the, having the theory, the theory and having the experience. It's like in my job, it's like in everything in our lives. So, yeah, there's a lot of mold on the surface. Let's write a piece of paper. I might be doing something wrong. The mold, the bacteria might be on the, um, on the substrate. I don't know, might be on the water. Let's do a test. Let's candle the egg. Yeah, I don't. I don't see the those live veins uh, that I see on the other, on the other one. Nah, I don't see veins in here. Shit. It should be pretty ev evident the the veins. I see where they were, but yeah, they're not bright red. Nothing in here. Shit. Alright, let's check the other box. These ones are doing good. Alright, I got four good eggs for the time being. And... People, uh, we have in Portugal the story of Mufina Mench. So basically she was trying to sell eggs that were still not out of the chicken's ass. And uh, I was falling for the, um, the same the same mistake uh, hey i got nine eggs oh awesome uh, if i uh, i can pay my the, the investment and, and all that stuff no i'm gonna get probably in best case scenario only four and um, that's for that's for me to to learn uh, i think that probably on the next clutch is if it is the spider mojave i'm gonna tr try and do maternal incubation because she's pretty big i just need to increase the um, temperature on the thermostat one degree um and i will have to probably buy an incubator or, or build an incubator uh yeah i know all the theory but uh i i need to learn how to do it the, in practical terms